matches, dude. Especially, uh, I appreciate everyone that's been sticking with the stream from the start, because I know there's tons of amazing events happening today. But uh, if you guys, you know, chose to stop by and support a SoCal tournament with the stream, definitely shout out to you. But we're here, we're here for uh, Larry and Charlie, man. First time I've seen these guys face off in Ultimate. I've seen so many Fox Dill sets with them in uh, Smash 4. So let's see what's different this Ooh, time. Ooh, hold the jabs there. And when, when you get a rapid jab by the edge or like on the side of a platform, you can hold it because they don't get pushed off. Wow. So you just like wait till your character gets pushed back and then you like end it off. So you, you can get a good like extra 10%, 10 plus percent damage. Something I've uh, noticed about Fox in this game especially is that the Nair has become an all purpose oh, tool. Oh, yes. Uh, early percents, hit Nair, get damage. Mid percents, hit Nair, get more oh, damage. Oh, and that new knockback on the shine, a little bit more uh, knockback on it makes it a little bit better for getting shine as yeah. guards. Yeah, and it, it's it's really interesting because shine was, an, again, kind of a troll move in Smash 4, and it's, it's actually gotten bumped to the point where it's pretty good now. Yeah. Great shine spike. I didn't think I would say that. <laughs> <laughs> in this game, but uh, great shine spike from Larry in the Fox Ditto. Dude, you, you only... Never uh, change, man. <laughs> but Larry, uh, right there, Larry going to get caught up by the up smash from Charlie the King. And, you know, those, that up smash got buffed so hard. It, it's huge. It's stronger. You, It's so hard to land against that move. Yeah, especially in this game where there's one air dodge and uh, just being... One and done, man. Being under someone is such a huge advantage. That up smash just becomes one of the best anti-airs in the game. Okay, right now, Larry on the hunt, trying to get these up airs, but Charlie retaliating, going to get that dash attack. What's the ledge trap here? Okay, Sour Nair, again, a new, another new trap, trying to get the back air. Ooh, trying to bring back a classic with that fair footstool. Maybe just the drag down fair in general. Might have been enough to just take that one out. Oh, Ooh, up nice smash. Move. Yep, really Great good movement stuff. from Larry, baiting him with that jump forward. Yeah, and that's, gonna land on top of him. that's one of the strongest things about Fox is he moves so quick, his full hop goes so far up, and then he can come back down so fast. So Larry just baiting him with pure movement. Saw that he went for the up smash. He's like, all right, sick, Ooh. I'm going to get this whip punish. And wow, that Firefox is strong. That was untackable. Yikes. Larry went a little too aggro off stage, trying to make it count for that forward air, but not in position to pull that one off. And now Charlie has an opportunity, racking up all the damage, bringing this right back. Nice, get the empty hop right over him, get the grab in Ooh, time. Ooh, the call out. Wait a minute. What's the lead trap going to be? But Larry finds his way out of the corner. That pressure from Charlie could have been so much more damage. Ooh, calls out the jump. No jump here on Larry. Oh, oh we're having the Nair Wars. Nair oh. to Nair, but Charlie's is the one that matters. Nair up smash, a Fox classic. We're never going to see the end of that move. Yeah, that will always be a thing. <laughs> Since the dawn of time, Fox could Nair up smash. And it is still a thing, and it will forever be a thing. And right there, like you said, both of them were really fishing for that Nair. Yeah. Whoever got that sour hit Nair was going to cash out with that game. And Charlie is the one to nail it first. Charlie now up 1-0. It's so great to see that Charlie is like, new, new game, but I still want to beat you, Larry. I still want to prove that I'm the superior Fox. I'm the best Fox in SoCal. Oh, yeah. And it's funny. Charlie has a, a decent history here in SoCal. You know, he started off, he was really young, and... He just said he was going to be the best box, and he just smack-talked in the Facebook group. Yeah. Book group. And yeah. <laughs> look at him now. Funny enough, I remember Champ had to actually be the one, not even Larry. Champ <laughs> had to be the one to set, shut him down with the box. Good uh, times, good man. Good times, good times. But now, Ooh. I mean, look at him now. He put in the grind, you know, played so hard in Smash 4. And I'd say maybe, like, after about two years, he started getting those results. And this guy would come out to so much locals. He was on the grind, and I really respect when people put in that work. Oh, yeah. Charlie's one of the hardest workers in the in the business, so he has a lot of my respect as a player. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh and, and there uh, you got to respect that narrow smash yet again. Charlie getting the first dog. Looking so smooth with this Fox right now. Oh, Larry's got to speed it up, man. He's got to turn it up a little bit. Yeah, I, I, I think this the young and Charlie, man, is uh, moving a little too quick here for Larry. Ooh, but that up smash out of shield, get him out of here. That's, that's the buff you were talking about. Dude, it kills so early, and that was no rage. Yeah, Fox has always been a light character, though. Yeah, they made him, I definitely like that they made him more of that glass cannon build. You know, they made him lighter, but they made his up smash better. Just, it, it seems they gave him a lot of great offensive tools. Okay, Larry, trying to see if we can continue the juggles here. Love the Nair placement. Oh, the Ooh. drag down forward here. Trying to set up a tech but oh, <laughs> get off of me. Another up smash right to the face. So I heard Nair's a good option. You Nair <laughs> my shield, eat this up smash, and Larry is going to take the lead right under Charlie. And Charlie was the one who took the first stock in this game. Yeah. I really do like how so far in Smash Ultimate we see this magic swing back and forth. All right, what well, you can do, I can do too. Gonna oh, get the up smash out of shield. Oh, wait a nice minute, down tilt. tilt. 
Oh, the forward air. Yeah, I'm really interested with the changes they made the forward air. I feel like generally it's better. Feels a little bit bigger. Oh, wait a minute. Tech Chase tries to get the tech away, but Larry going to air dodge earlier. Get out of that situation here. Oh, man. And Charlie has to find the stock before Larry Ooh, gets the kill that here. Back air placement so good. Not enough to kill, but he's in a horrible oh. position on stage. Wait a Oh, wow. Is he just dead? Okay. Charlie able to weave around that Firefox. Larry was putting on the pressure. And here's the corner. Oh, my pressure. goodness. Wow. Call out the shield drop. Larry's Running. so. So good at that. That's the, he just knows, that's dude. That's a veteran play, man. Dude, that's the 10 years of experience, that's dog. That's 10 like, year back air, dude. That one's been like <laughs> aging like a fine wine, dude. That's crazy. Yo, I got this 10 year back air ready. 10 I know. years of back airs, man. I've been doing this since before you were even a thought, man. It's so crazy because it looks like Charlie got shield poked. Like, that's how precise. Like, Larry hit him on the exact frame that he dropped the shield, it looked like. And. Yeah. What precision from Larry, knowing exactly when Larry or Charlie would feel safe yeah. dropping that shield. When I talk to Larry about this game and uh, how he thinks about the game, he thinks in like, all right, I figure out how people normally like to react in certain timings. Like, it doesn't matter who you are. When I jump this way or move this way, you tend to react like this. Yes. And I have that just dialed down to a T. Yeah, and he's very good at it. Definitely showing here. Good angle from Charlie, but no double jump here. Larry trying to throw out meaty hitbox to catch the illusion, but no go. Yeah, Nair, and, uh, Nair seems to have replaced up tilt as the optimal move to ledge trap with the Fox. Yes, for sure. They tried to go for the down tilt on the illusion as well. That's the shield pressure. Oh, the. Oh. <laughs> that move is so strong. Charlie going to sneak that right under Larry's nose. Larry overextending with that up smash, and Charlie oh going to take goodness. it with the forward smash. This is so hilarious watching Fox titles where they're just jumping on top of each other with Nair over and over. Ooh, the Nair. Okay. Oh, oh. no. Yo, we taking those That's straight to the bank. That's also a 10-year up B. That was definitely some old man reactions <laughs> there. He did not angle his up B at all. Yeah, you really going to do Larry like that, though. That's my friend, man. <laughs> That's why I'm here. If, if, if I don't roast him, no one will. <laughs> there you go, man. And right now, two stocks to one. You know, Larry did, that, did have that unfortunate SD. So how is he going to bring this back? I mean... We are dealing with two glass cannons, so Larry can just get that little bit of momentum. He can bring this back to even, but will Charlie let him do that? Ooh, down tilt. It's also great for stopping oh, this dang. illusion, too. Oh, off stage. Oh, oh, oh dang. I, I thought the Yo, shine was coming for Charlie sure. Charlie was going for the footstool, though. You saw that double jump, that low double jump. You already know. Oh, trying to cheese him, though? Oh, there's great an air. Tech. Great tech, yes. Straight to the ledge. Nice stuff from Charlie, man. That's something that hasn't changed. Charlie has some of the best techs in the business. Uh-oh. Let me get this free hit. He's charging it longer than usual. We're just going to wait. <laughs> <laughs> that the stare down, man. Oh man, and Charlie's starting to rack it up. Now, if Charlie gets a sour nair, I would not be surprised if that's enough to kill. Can Larry close out the stock on the ledge trap here? Down to Ooh, down to oh, right. He's up to man. I'm gonna use this tail whip. Nice stuff. Yeah, down down to you know getting significant buffs. Another one of uh, Fox's great combo starting moves. So Larry gonna close it out. 73% here. Can Charlie close this out? Can he? Not choke this lead, man. I, and I hate to bring it up, but it, it happens. Oh, yeah. Larry's actually the comeback master. Like, he actually thrives in situations like this. Yeah, where you, you look never like you're going to win, but Larry just comes back and steals it right from under your legs. Yeah, you never give Larry an inch. He'll take the entire Ooh. mile. Wow, trying to go for that deep. Can he even make it back? He yes, he does. does. The back air. The shorted. That the was magnets. such a. Okay. Wow, that okay. was so good. Charlie, that was an amazing shortened side B. Larry knew his only out right there. He could close it out, but Charlie just shortened the side B, which you can do now. There's three different distances. Nice. And because of that, Larry's back here whiffed, and he swapped the whole situation around, and it ended up with Charlie getting the one, uh, being the one with the back here hit. Wow, that was what so smart. What an illusionist, smart. man. What an illusionist he is. That That's, was great. Yeah. <laughs> that was really good. I love seeing the back and forth with two characters that are terrible at recovering, quote unquote. How do they both get around each other is like <laughs> edge guarding, especially when they're both so good at like abusing what makes the critter like it will get to the ledge. Yeah, exactly. And man, that that play was oh so good. Goodness. And many up airs. You know, we, we still got we playing yeah. box ball out here, dude. He's just kicking them over and over. Yeah, we we still got those up air combos. You know, it it doesn't really start off dash tag no more. But if you get that straight up air on the platform, oh, you cashing in for lots and lots of damage. Yeah, it does even more damage in this game, doesn't it? it that is more than sixteen, I think. Wow, that's. Actually, insane. X, it combos too. into itself still. <laughs> I don't know what I don't like. I don't know what Star Fox did <laughs> to Sakurai that made him love this character so much. But we thank you. We love seeing these foxes yeah. out here. Yeah, we, we take those, dog. But right now, Charlie gonna start again with the lead in this game, and Larry tries to get the no tech there, but Charlie gonna tech in 
And right now, Charlie's doing a really good job just surviving and racking up this damage. So, like, Charlie uh, one game away from eliminating Larry. And uh, funny enough, if he does eliminate Larry, that means Eon and Charlie both outplays Larry at this tournament. Oh, that wow. tech chase was mad good. Oh, yeah, and everyone, everyone's tripping out at how, you know, Larry outplays Light at Let's Make Moves. And right now, I mean, we, we got more foxes. <laughs> yeah, SoCal, man. we got lots and lots of foxes. And they've been hunting for Larry for a long time. But nice back there to catch with Lidstrom. Charlie's still looking really good here. 105% on Ooh, the Larry. Parry, great though. parry into the jab. Wow. And okay. he, like, hit him in the parry. Like, he I'll knew. See. He knew. Okay, the Firefox low here. Larry coming up onto the ledge. Okay, Charlie on the ledge here. Yeah, very patient play at the ledge here from Charlie. I really like it. And yeah, that's one thing you can do against Fox since his up tilt doesn't hit below the ledge. You can take your time. You don't, you're don't. you not really oh, forced. Oh, he fastball that back here at a terrible position. And that might be all Larry needs to win this. Oh, yeah. To and win to game five. Yeah, Larry will take that straight to the bank. Um, he'll take that lead. He'll start racking up this extra damage. Oh, the up smash. Does not hit that cross up dash and, attack. Yeah, and that kind of shows Charlie's hand that he's really desperate for this kill after dropping that SD. Ooh, the sparks, but the fourth throw gets an offstage situation. What is Charlie going to do to take the stock? Great angle, but no tech. Oh, you're even. Wait. Wow, trade? that timing. He still traded. Dude, so many people die trying to edge guard Firefox. I feel like, I feel like more people die trying to edge guard Firefox than people like edge guarding Firefox. Like yeah. the fox is getting edge guard by it. It's true, and they're not even ready to take. The fox is ready to take every time. But well, that one was unteckable. That was the red splash. Oh, like wow, that's yeah. how strong that move is. Yeah, they actually made it even stronger. <laughs> like, so for some reason, he just makes Firefox like even better, more of a kill move each game. <laughs> All right, so Larry has this lead. What will he do? The grab. He knows. He has instilled the fear in Charlie. Charlie does not want to get hit. Charlie does not want to go down here. Okay, here's the corner pressure. Charlie going to get that jump out a little bit earlier here. Okay, ooh, right, calling that's what Wow. You want. you want those big hits? You want to oh. keep your advantage with the up there. He stayed under Larry there. It could have been really bad. This is actually really close. This yeah, it's really bad. close. Oh, he caught him dashing. All Larry. right. Charlie, ooh, oh, that, that can be stressful. It can be a tilter. But when you are a top player, you have to have that mental stability. You have to be able to take the loss and be like, all right, I'm about to go into game five. I had that, but you know what? I might have SD'd. I might have done something dumb. But I got to come into this game number five completely clear-minded and come in and just focus. It is moments like these that separate the veteran top players from the mid-level, like, trying to get their up-and-comers. Oh, yeah, How they sure. deal with stress and, like, dropping a lead like that definitely can even make the most, like, stone, like, willed person just, just falter. So, like, Larry in a position with this game five now. Charlie had a huge lead, but he's gonna have to just bring back that same fire we saw in the earlier portion of that last Charlie time. can do it. We've seen him throughout this entire set body Larry. Like, yeah. he can definitely do it. But, I mean, I want you guys to do me a favor, and when you watch, or like, when you see Larry play, try to look at his face. He Stone has a poker cold. face almost. No emotion. This guy is soulless when he's playing this game, and sometimes, you gotta sell your soul, man. If you want that W, you gotta Ooh, sell that soul. And Larry. He does want that W. That trade was completely in Larry's favor. Charlie oh, yeah. tried to land on top of Fox, that up smash saying, no thank you. You know what emotion was on Larry's face when he landed that up smash? None. But there goes Charlie, running it right back. No percent taken. We're going back and forth here. Game five in the Fox Ditto. Loser of this is out of the tournament. Okay, Charlie in a really bad position. Larry just pressuring him in this corner or forcing him on this ledge. Oh, but he gets the up tilt, the jump. Okay, but Larry fights back with the jab. All right, trying to establish some presence here on stage. Going to jab him up. No parry here, but free dash attack anyway. Man, both these players just going back and forth. Pretty much even game. Two stocks apiece here. Larry trying to get back, trying to get the center stage control. Okay, here's an air. Okay, what's the lead trap going to be? Larry just nice. waiting back, reacts. But, wow, Charlie comes down with the down uh -oh. here. That's a big back here. This okay, edge guard means everything. Oh. oh, he's been missing the fair every single time. Great tech, though. Oh, on the stage, he wasn't ready for it. Yeah, and the fair spike can still trade with the uh, with the Firefox, but it's just a little harder. Larry's wave patiently here. Oh, he thought you were rolling. Oh, what? Wow, the greedy Charlie. up smash gets covered. Yeah, and Charlie is the first one to bite first, and Larry's going to take advantage of that. He jumps right over, and how many times have we seen Larry jump up and over a move and whiff punish it? Like I said, he's really utilizing this movement Fox has. He's up, he's down, he's left, he's right. Where is this character going? What? Dang, straight to the blast zone, I guess. 39%. 
Going right back and forth. Yo. These guys are so Last even. stock. Game five. Larry oh, Lur versus Perry Charlie the, the King. Jab. Dang. And Charlie going to retaliate with the parry. Definitely something we don't see Larry do too much. Oh, my God. They're going near for near. But here comes Charlie. Opportunity strikes here. Getting some good Ooh, We got the cross up. up. And that sour hit of up to it is exactly what you want with Fox. Oh, wow. turn around grab. Off stage. Grab. Wow, you saw the sparks on that illusion. Almost caught it. But right now, Charlie, Charlie has everything. He has the ledge. Great ledge presence. Very okay. interrupt spot. Oh, oh he gets that's the, the one play. that matters. That's the one. And that's the one it. that takes he it. He pops off. Charlie oh. takes it over Larry.